Bum bum. Okay. It's almost too bright today, isn't it? Very odd. Right. Um, Axion, I'm going to fire off your comment. Don't worry, it's not directly to you. It's more just firing off it just to <laughs> move on. We can say I sneezed, I went to the shop, or I gave a donation. Of course, I understand that these things are doings, that these doings are determined. I wouldn't have said that. I'm not, I'm not saying it's wrong, but, you know, I'm not a determined sort of guy. It's not my kick. It's probably true. It's in brackets after everything. I don't go on about determinism. The language smashes the eye into being. I, I totally agree. The obviously the the letter word I comes from language. Without language, um, if you're a horse, you don't bother about I. And we might come on to that later. Horses, that is. Why would it be wrong to believe that we feel we are doing these things? What the video was saying, and the video was called Can You Feel It? Because I see it at the top of your comment there. I sneezed. I went to the shops. I gave a donation. What are you feeling? Do you feel like you went to the shops? Do you feel like you sneezed? Okay, let's go with that one, besides the donation, because that I sneezed takes us in. I sneezed. Okay, just after your sneeze, you've got other sensations going on, which are, see, this is words and they're buggers. You can feel the sensations of the sneeze, you know, that inus of the sneeze. But you don't have any inus after you go to the shops. And this is, well, let's, let's see if we can back in through this way. I, the only thing I worked out before this video is I wanted to say, I've, I've, well, I've done this three or four times, at least I know, because I remember Ricardo goes to the dictionary every time. Feelings and emotions. I wanted to throw them, one of them away because I'm sitting here now not knowing what the dealing, the, the difference is between a feeling and an emotion. And Ricardo can go to the dictionary and find that these things are feelings and these things are emotions. But if I can't now sit here and work it out for myself, what the dictionary says is nonsense, isn't it, to me? Because I don't feel it. I don't, I don't, you know. So what did I think? I, I thought of an example. Can't remember what the example was now. Of what my, okay, let's go for things. Um, fear. Is it a feeling or an emotion? You see what I mean? Um, it'll be in a dictionary as one or the other, somewhere along the line. But who, who cares or knows unless you know? Um, anger. I feel anger. I feel angry. But surely it's an emotion. <laughs> Let's see what I mean. Okay. So I'd like to throw one of them away. I'll throw emotions away because we get to emoting, which I did in the last video, which is not a very nice word, emoting. We can have feelings and we can feel things. And we um, we are feeling something. It the, the the words work better than emotions. So when I'm throwing emotions away, I'm not throwing away what you think is an emotion like fear or anger. If you think those are emotions, I'm just putting those in the same bundle as feelings. I have a feeling of fear. I have a feeling of anger, etc. So we got it. We're all in the same bundle. Which is just feelings, and I'm just throwing emotions aside just to make it easier. And in feelings, which are kind of these mentally thinky, thoughty things to a certain extent, 
but they kind of are thinky thoughty things without thinky and thoughts, are they? Like you can feel fear without thinking, oh, I feel fear, or shit, a ghost. Um, but they're ephemeral sort of head things. I sneezed, so including in the feeling, feelings, our feelings, I feel, um, I feel my finger. It's a feeling of, you know, if you do it really hard, I feel pain in my finger. Otherwise, you come down the scale and you just, I feel my finger. Um, smelling's a feeling and all that sort of stuff. It might sound wrong because it's not like language right, but if we can put out all that stuff into feelings. I sneezed. Okay, now we're 10 minutes after the sneeze. We can't physically feel it anymore. What I'm saying in the video, can you feel it? No, you can't feel the sneeze anymore. All you can do is have the memory of it and then that's it. Okay. Go into the shops, you come back from the shops or it's a day later, all you've got is the memory of it. I gave a donation, you've got the memory of giving the donation. So it isn't in, in your comments it's something it's something as though I was bothering about the word I. It isn't bothering about the word I, it's bothering about the word feeling. And as I said in the video the other word, calculation. You do not feel that you went to the shops. You have a memory of going to the shops and then calculate that you did go to the shops. Same for a donation, same for I sneezed 10 minutes later. You calculate from the memory that you did sneeze. Now, what will we, I forget what the example was in... Um, when I was saying, can you feel it? Um, cause it'd be good if I could go straight back and use it again, because this is the place to do it. Um, it was the free will, of course, wasn't it? You've done something, you've made a choice, choice to drink tea at this absolute particular stage of the game. A slurp, don't put it down on the table because that's where the microphone is. And it goes thunk, free will. So I chose to put it on the floor where it wouldn't make the thunk noise. Where in all that is a feeling, feeling, that I had free will to do it. That's what I was on about. There's no feeling, there's no physical feeling. There's no mental feeling, feeling that I did it. I've got a memory of doing what I did and then I calculate from that memory of what I did anything else. I calculate that I had free will to do it or I must have done it due to free will. That's what I was saying in the video. The free will is not a feeling. I don't feel as though I had free will to do it. I calculate that I had free will to do it. Just like from the memory, I calculate that I went to the shops. I calculate that I gave a donation. I calculate that I sneezed. You might think, well, you did sneeze. It doesn't need much of a calculation, but it still needs calculating. And this is how miss things happen when you calculate wrong that you did something, when you didn't do it because you miscalculated or miss memoried but you don't feel like you sn sneeze 10 minutes later you don't feel like you went to the shops you don't feel like you gave a do donation you don't feel like you've got free will you have a memory and a calculation and this is what i was on about and that's 10 minutes now so i'll stop going on about it again so it's not about the word i or and things like that it's 10 minutes, screen goes off. It's purely stating, as, as a, 
a, a basis point so then we could go on to talk about free will or whatever else knowing that it's not a feeling we don't feel as though it is what it is we calculate what it is and then we can talk about what goes into the calculation to see if that calculation might be wrong or right or how it could be improved because calculations can always be improved we'll always have to deal with the memory that we've got that's just imprinted but after that memory is brought up to go into the calculation we can then discuss what goes on in the calculation because obviously at the moment what comes from the memory of doing something is also the memory of people telling you that you've had free will to do it so you put the two together and the equals the end result is or this way the end result is i had free will exercised my free will to drink tea right now and put it down again on the floor it's a calculation you do not feel as though you had free will to do it unless anybody can explain to me that they do somehow feel as though they had free will to do things feel it not calculate it feel it and this is what the video is about because this is what people in the string of talking to people they say well you can't get around the fact that like everybody feels as though they've got free will and i'm trying to because so many people have said that more people listen to it more people say it again but i'm saying stop think do you really feel as though you had free will i think the answer is no but if somebody can better explain how they do feel it um i want to hear about it friends i really do bye